Hey there guys, how's it going? So, I'm here to start a pretty big movie night vlog. We are not going to be watching one, not two, but three movies for this movie night vlog. And they're all going to be at the movie theaters, none at my house. I just got in the car, I'm about to head over to the movie theater to um, watch the first movie out of three for tonight. And that movie will be Frozen 2, I'm going to be seeing it in IMAX. Um... I like the first Frozen movie. The second one looks promising. Uh, we'll see how it goes, though. So this is going to be a pretty big movie night vlog, and I will also have a guest joining me uh, later in this vlog right after Frozen 2. So, uh, yeah, this is going to be lots of fun. Um, I hope you guys enjoy the guest, too. Um, so without further ado, let's just go ahead and start this uh, big movie night vlog, and we'll head over to the theater and check out Frozen 2. And another thing, too, is that uh, right now it's currently 3 o'clock in the afternoon. You know, just got back from school. And this movie night vlog will not be ending until midnight tonight. It's going to be, I know it's going to be draining, you know, watching three movies at the theater. Um, so we'll just play it by ear, see how it goes. Uh, again, currently I'm on my way to see Frozen 2. Hopefully it's good, but we'll find that out once the movie's done. This is a vile waste of taxpayer dollars. Alright, so I just got out of scene Frozen 2, and uh, lucky for me, I got to go see it with Ben O'Connor. This, uh, this is very interesting. We originally were going to go see Knives Out together, but then found out that we were also seeing Frozen 2 together. And uh, yeah, that was quite a coincidence. We, we got some food. Uh, we got about an hour left before uh, Knives Out comes out. So like we said, we just got out of Frozen 2. What did you think of it, Ben? I thought it was okay. Um, I thought the ending was really rushed, mm -hmm. but yeah, I don't know. Yeah, it was, it was about the same as the first. I didn't love the first. I didn't love this one. So the same as the first. Yeah, I would have to agree with you on the ending. It was a bit rushed, but I liked all the songs. They were really nice, and I think the animation was uh, super stellar. So we're just gonna, you know, eat our food and wait until knives out, and uh, we'll see you guys after that. Okay, so. We got some time to spare until uh, Knives Out. Uh, we are headed to Best Buy right now. I think Ben is looking for farewell. The, the farewell. He's looking for that because we also stopped at Target, but they don't have the Blu-ray for that. So we're, we saw that Best Buy had limited stock for that. And yeah. Hopefully it's there. Hopefully it's there, yeah. So we'll head over there. We'll update you guys. When we uh, when we head over there, yeah, he's a little upset, but that's okay. I want to cry a little bit. I want to cry a little bit. You go ahead and do that. Yeah, we're just looking around, seeing what else they have. I don't know. I mean, with Black Friday coming up, there's not much I want to spend. So, but yeah, I mean, all these Pixar steel books, I will get it. Not the steel books, but I'll eventually get those 4Ks. We'll see though. Even Aladdin, like, this would just be such a cool movie to have in 4K, but who knows when I'll get that. One day, guys, I will get you. One day. Well, they dropped it down to $25, which isn't a huge sale, but, you know, I think now with the holiday season, they're lowering their prices a bit, so. Not yet, though. I Eventually, I will get this, but again. I won't get it now. Okay. Alrighty, Ben, so what happened? Oh, I asked the person and they had it. They got it already. Happy day for Ben. He got his movie. And he got you all the way. I got nothing. So, uh, I'll wait some other time to get some movies. So we're headed back to the theater right now. Uh, we still have to wait a bit longer to see Knives Out, but uh, we'll give you our thoughts on the movie after that, uh, after we watch that movie.
Okay, so we just got out of Knives Out. What did you think of the movie? I uh, loved it. Loved very, it? Uh, very fun. Very fun, yeah. It was a very fun movie. I think I, I thought it was uh, well written. And uh, yeah, it was like, runtime was like two hours two hours long. It went by real fast for me. It was a quick and easy movie. Um, yeah, had lots of fun watching it. The writing was excellent. So that is going to do it for the second movie for tonight. Ben here is gonna head out. Yeah, thank you so much for, uh, you know, you invited me to go see Knives Out, and uh, it was a coincidence that we got to see Frozen 2 together, so it was a fun night, so uh, thank you for that. All right, yeah, so now I'm about to go back and see A Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood, and after that movie, I'll let you guys know my thoughts on that. But uh, before I go see A Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood, I'm going to head over to the gas station, uh, get myself a drink, because I really do need that right now. Um, just need some... Just need some energy right now to get me through the next few hours. I also need to um, scrape off my windshield, which will be a lot of fun to do. I also should have mentioned that we got these really cool Knives Out posters for uh, being for uh, seeing it a week early. So that was super cool to get uh, with that early screening of the movie. So yeah, I got my classic can of Sprite. I am about to uh, watch Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood. I'm pretty excited for that movie. Uh, I hope Tom Hanks, um, I know that Tom Hanks will do a great job in the role as uh, Mr. Rogers. Uh, looks like a very fun and heartwarming story and I'm uh, looking forward to uh, seeing that movie. So without further ado, let's go ahead and uh, watch A Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood. I think the best thing we can do is to let people know boom, that each one of them is precious. So I just got done seeing A Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood, and it was a very well-directed movie. Uh, very the, the way it looked was very nice, and Tom Hanks quite literally became Fred Rogers in this movie. His performance was so true to how Fred Rogers, you know, really acted. And, you know, I would I would recommend the, the uh, Won't You Be My Neighbor documentary over this film, but this was still a really, really great movie. And, uh, yeah, just that Tom Hanks performance alone was uh, worth the admission price. So, yeah, that was going to do it for this big movie night vlog. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. You know, I had Ben with me. Uh, it was a lot of fun to have him in this video. And then, you know, watching three movies at the theater, which honestly I probably will never do again because it is 12, 11 at night right now. And I am insanely tired. I, I just need, I need to go home and get some rest. So it was, you know, it was a, it was a long day, uh, a long time to be away from the house, but it was a lot of fun watching uh, three different movies at the theater. So. Yeah, that's going to do it for this video. Again, hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time.